the computer the computer has become a part of the media only in recent years in the 1960s and 70s computer were mostly used by big companies and businessmen very few people could buy a computer to be used at home in the 1980s and 90s there was an incredible growth in the computer sales the popularity of the internet the world wide web and the email have made computers inevitable in the modern world have you ever thought about the advantages of the internet it helps millions of people to communicate with each other quickly and cheaply moreover it enables quick access to knowledge how did man come to invent the computer man learned to count long ago but the first calculating device he invented seems to have been the abacus it's a wooden frame with horizontal rods or wires carrying beads the counting is done by moving the beads one by one along the rods or wires the first mechanical adding machine was made by pascal in france and improved upon by leibniz in germany it was charles babbage of england who made the first calculating machine called the difference engine in 1822 later he designed the even more powerful analytical engine but could not get it made its basic design is remarkably similar to the modern electronic computer the processing of data with mechanical machines started with the 1890 us census it was done with punched cards and tabulating machines designs and made by herman hollerith later these machines came to be used in business industry and the government for processing data the first electronic computer were made in the late 40s in the usa germany and england eniac made in the usa is the best known among these first genera- generation computers the invention of the transistor in 1948 led to the making of the second generation machines in the 50s then came the third generation in the 60s where the machines using integrated circuits the invention of microprocessor in 1971 brought the fourth generation with the each generation with each new generation computers have become more powerful more reliable smaller in size and cheaper the fifth generation promised by the japanese is yet to come